Vincent by Don McLean is a song with many references, rich detail, and deep meaning. From Don McLean himself to the namesake and meaning behind the song, it goes without saying that there are plenty of things that can be unpacked and discussed in relation to this song. So who is Don McLean? Don McLean is an American singer-songwriter best known for his 1971 hit American Pie. Some of his other famous works include Castles in the Air, And I Love You So, and of course, Vincent. His early musical influences were the likes of Frank Sinatra, Pete Seeger, and Buddy Holly. Beyond these, however, McLean became interested in folk music, such as the Weavers and various other musicians. McLean's early life interest in music was propelled at the age of 15 when his father died. After fulfilling his father's request and graduating in 1963, he began working with agent Harold Leventhal and soon began to perform more frequently as he saw his success grow. So what's so important about Vincent? Well, this song is written about Vincent Van Gogh, the post-impressionist artist who is most famous for his work, Starry Night. Van Gogh was a Dutch artist who is known for his post-impressionist paintings. Some of his most famous works include The Potato Eaters, Sunflowers, and The Starry Night. Despite being incredibly talented, Van Gogh was plagued by mental illness and poverty throughout his life. Sadly, his life ended when it shouldn't have. Van Gogh died by suicide in 1890 at the age of 37. Don McLean began writing Vincent in late 1970, inspired by a book of poems by Vincent Van Gogh's brother, Theo. McLean had always been a fan of Van Gogh, so there's no surprise he was drawn to this topic. The song is written in McLean's own words as a eulogy of sorts for the artist. He tries to capture what he believes to be Van Gogh's essence as a human being. He wanted to use this song as a way to argue that Van Gogh wasn't crazy, only sick. McLean used the painting, The Starry Night, as a way to grab hold of what he perceived to be Van Gogh's essence as a human being. He turned this painting into a song, and in doing so, gave Van Gogh the recognition he always deserved but never received during his lifetime. He was aware of the artist's suffering and wanted the song to be a way to show that. In fact, some of the lyrics from the song easily portray this and show McLean's understanding of Van Gogh's pain. Now I understand what you tried to say to me and how you suffered for your sanity. So what does this mean? Well, McLean wanted to enlighten people about Van Gogh and his story. He wanted to show the world that Van Gogh was more than just a crazy artist. He was a sick man who deserved sympathy and acknowledgement and was in fact never as crazy as he'd been deemed. McLean wanted to show that Van Gogh was a man who suffered for his art. He was misunderstood and unappreciated in his time, but through this song, McLean showed something more. He revealed the man behind the curtain. The opening line, Starry Starry Night, refers to the painting A Starry Night, paint your palette blue and gray, reflects the prominent colors of the painting and shows the tendency of Van Gogh to view the world in a darker light, even though he was an incredibly talented artist. Though the sky may be bright, Van Gogh's early career was full of struggle. Drab palettes dominated his paintings as he gained inspiration from struggles, and as his work was influenced by famous Dutch painters such as Rembrandt. The song also references other paintings by Van Gogh, such as sunflowers, the plane trees near Arles, and wheat fields under threatening skies. These paintings are both significant to Van Gogh's story and add further depth to the song. An example of this is when McLean says, Colors changing hue, morning fields of amber grain, which refers to wheat fields under threatening skies, art that showcases golden fields of grain under skies that strongly contrast the brighter hues of the painting. This isn't simply referenced for the fun of it either. In fact, this reference delves into the stormy struggles of both Van Gogh's life and mind at the time. The Wheatfield paintings were some of the few happy moments in his life, providing both a creative outlet and mental escape for the artist. Yet above them, impending dark clouds threatened both the serenity of the painting and Van Gogh's own mental state. The line, they would not listen, they did not know how, perhaps they'll listen now, reflects Van Gogh's struggle to be heard and understood. This line speaks to the artist's feeling of isolation and how he was never truly appreciated in his time. Despite Van Gogh's incredible talent, he was never given the credit he deserved. He was always seen as crazy, and his work was never fully appreciated until after his death. It wasn't until the 20th century that Van Gogh's work started to gain the recognition it always deserved. This line also has a double meaning. 
Not only is McLean speaking to how Van Gogh was never properly appreciated, but he's also making a call to action. He's urging listeners to perhaps take a second look at Van Gogh's work and see it for the brilliance that it is. If you think the impact of this song stopped at just Van Gogh, you'd be wrong. In fact, Vincent had a much larger impact than McLean could have anticipated. This song has been used in popular culture numerous times. It's a song about appreciating value before it's too late, appreciating clarity and not calling it sanity, and never judging a book by its cover. Ultimately, the song reflects what it's like to be misunderstood, and this has had a great impact on many popular artists too. It was Tupac's favorite song and was played on his deathbed. The Irish singer Brian Kennedy even sang it at the footballer George Best's funeral. Vincent by Don McLean is a song with great meaning, depth, and detail. It's a song about being misunderstood, valuing talent before it's gone, and never judging a book by its cover. There's no question that Don McLean had insight when he wrote this song. He was able to see the man behind the artist and appreciate Van Gogh for more than just his work. He showed the world that vision and clarity that he had and that Van Gogh had as well. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed learning more about Vincent by Don McLean. This song is truly a work of art in itself and has a lot to offer in terms of both lyrics and meaning. That's it for this video though. Remember to leave a like and subscribe if you want to stay up to date on our latest videos and hit that notification bell so you never miss out on a future upload.